Hey guys, let's get on the fast track. In this video, let's talk about a mentor for getting started in photography and who helped me get my start. And it all starts right now. How did I get my start in photography? First off, I was given a free point-and-shoot camera. I played around with and took some pictures and soon learned its limitations. I didn't know anything about cameras, what to look for or what questions to ask. I found out that a guy working in the same place that I was working was interested in photography also. His name was Glenn Edmondson. He even had a dark room in his basement. Wow. After talking with him for a while, I kind of knew what to look for in a camera. He even found someone that was selling a camera like what would be pretty good for what I wanted. I even got a flash to go with it. I was taking some photos and taking them in to work with me to show him and ask questions. I guess he thought I was doing pretty good because one time he said that he was doing a wedding this up and coming weekend and that would I go with him to help him out at the wedding. And of course I did. That really opened my eyes. Right then and there, I said to myself, I can do this. He also showed me he was getting his photos printed at a professional photo lab. That was all I needed. Now I even had some sample pictures to show that I had taken at Glenn's wedding. That's all it took. No school, no lessons, no degree. One mentor and all I had to do was do what he did. That wedding with Glenn was in May. By the end of the summer, I had photographed four weddings. Then Christmas was coming around, so then it was uh, family photos. And by the time next May come around, I decided to go full-time. And you know what? I was a professional photographer. There is no diploma or credentials. All I had to do was say it. I am a professional photographer. Made some business card and some letterhead. Did I know everything about photography? Not even close. Did I know all the settings on the camera? Not even close again. Guess who does know all the camera settings on them cameras? The guy selling the cameras at the camera store. So I would go in and ask him. If that one didn't know, the guy at the next camera store did. It didn't take long to get the answers I needed. Around then I joined the Professional Photographers of America, better known as the PPA. I started to hire the odd helper to help me with weddings. They would go with me a few times. Then there would be a bride wanting us to take pictures at her wedding on a day that I was already booked up. So they would ask if my helper would come do their wedding. Then the helper knew right away that he could do weddings himself. I would actually encourage him to become a professional photographer and help them get going. I had more work than I wanted or could handle. So when I was overbooked, I would recommend him. I not only knew how much my mentor had helped me see that I could do it just as well as anyone else. I could see the light go on with people that I mentored. I think a mentor is better than any schooling, internet lessons, or all the books in the library. This is my opinion and my opinion only. Take it or leave it. I hope you find your mentors. You'll be surprised how much people are willing to share. Take care, guys, and good luck.